I believe that's true, yes. I don't believe that the way we see things in the world is independent of the human mind, the actual things we see. Um, so another part of our theory, of the conscious realism theory, is that our, our perceptions are actually sitting on an interface that, that we have evolved to use as something which is most, um, uh, which gives us the best fitness to continue in the world. It's an evolutionary thing. The interface has icons on it, just like a computer desktop does, and the icons interact with each other, but, and, and we call those icons objects, and we call the interactions physics, for example. The desktop itself is the space-time, uh, but that is not the necessarily the structure of reality, it's how we see reality. Now, the relationship between these things and how we put them together, whatever they are, in whatever interface, is still subject to mathematics, uh, mathematical investigation. So mathematics sits outside of the world as we see it in some sense. It's, 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 it's fundamental to the way we see structure and relationship. And, and it's, it, it is uh, continuously getting richer and richer as we discover more of it. So one of the great mysteries in, uh, for physicists in particular is why should mathematics be so useful in the physical sciences? In fact, Eugene Wigner, one of the great physicists of the last century, wrote a paper, and there have been many papers since, on the unreasonable effectiveness of mathematics. Um, but my own personal belief is it's not unreasonable. It, it's simply, um, in, you know, people discover mathematical theorems which seem to have nothing to do with any outside reality that we've experienced. It's just art. It's an artistic, creative process that discovers new mathematics. I'm sure Edward Frankel is going to talk about these things, and uh, he's a leading exponent of, of that. Um, and, you know, through our artistic sense, we discover new mathematics. And somehow, within a few years, that mathematics gets used by physicists. This itself is a mystery, and I don't mean to reduce the mystery. I mean to say that the, the mystery is about the fact that mathematics is something very deep and fundamental in the nature of mind itself.